Good morning, East Alabama and West Georgia. This is Kevin Moon from God's Country. It's time for your primetime forecast on Dr. Don's weather. Now, here's my friend, Dr. Don. Good morning, East Alabama and West Georgia. Welcome to your Sunday. Happy Father's Day for Sunday, June 19, 2022. A little present for you out there this morning. It is nice. Low relative humidities, it feels good out there. A little bit of a fall crisp to the air. Hey, it's time now for your primetime forecast. We'll tell you how long this great weather is going to last and when the heat returns and when we expect our next chance of rain. Coming up in this edition of your primetime forecast from the Alpha Weather Center, Jamie Dukas, your local Alpha agent. Hit that link at the top of this video so that you can request that cost-free, no-obligation insurance quote and become eligible to win the Dr. Don Weather app and receive a car freshie from k &L Car Charms as well as a shot at a $25 gift card from the store with the red door, Corner 56, and a $25 gift card from Meadows Farm Equipment on Highway 431 just south of Widawi. Don't forget, we will be in uh, on location coming up this Saturday at the New Hope Volunteer Fire Department in Widawi. Uh, we're about halfway between Widawi and Woodland on County Road 56, 3490 County Road 56. We want you to come hang out with us, folks. We're going to be there from 9 a.m. until 3 p.m. Saturday. We're going to be doing giveaways, including Dr. Don T-shirts, bumper stickers, and keychains. Live broadcast all day long. We'll be doing interviews. We've got special guests lined up to come by. Jamie Dukas will be hanging out with us, and he's going to bring some great prizes to give away as well. Also, WTVM staff meteorologist Dana Barker will stop by and hang out with us when we have folks there from God's Country and also the I school sports network and all of our supporters on dr don's weather we want you to come by and hang out with us as well come by get a neck hug and hang out with us at the turkey shoot this saturday at the new hope volunteer fire department in widawi alabama also coming up on july 30th we're going to be at warren sewell field for the Vern fest little texas will be in concert along with kevin moon and callie knight the gates open at 5 p.m. Show starts at 7 p.m. on Saturday, July 30th. All right, let's go ahead and get started with your forecast. Don't forget to follow us over on YouTube. Hit that subscribe button and click that little bell so that when we go live for severe weather, you'll get that automatic push notification you get it instantly so you know that we're on doing severe weather coverage for you all right so here we go for today we had a cold front dip through alabama yesterday that thing has uh, pretty much stalled out across extreme south alabama south georgia and so that has pushed the relative humidity levels way down and we're down into the 60s this morning and that makes it feel much, much nicer outside. I mean, it's, it, it's just beautiful. Go sit on the front porch, drink you a cup of coffee, and enjoy this beautiful weather we've got today. No thunderstorm activity is anticipated across Alabama or Georgia. As we look at Monday, pretty much the same. Maybe a few scattered showers along the Gulf Coast regions of Alabama and northwest Florida, but we're high and dry across East Alabama and West Georgia, and the same on Tuesday. As a matter of fact, our next chance of rain won't come until Friday. And before we get there, the heat will be on the return, as well as humidity values. By the time we get to Wednesday and Thursday, we're going to be flirting with 100 degrees both days. Now, you're going to hear these fear mongers out there and the clickbait folks on social media that's going to be jumping up and down and screaming and saying that this is heat of historical values, generational stuff. You've never seen anything like this before. That's all hogwash, folks. Uh, if you go back and look at historical weather records, you'll see that uh, the night, back in the 1930s, uh, pretty much that entire decade, was extremely hot and we hit 100 plus many times during the month of June 
And it's not unusual to see that happen two or three times throughout the summer across Alabama and Georgia anyway. Uh, so this is nothing unusual. History, weather history repeats itself. Now, it has been a minute since we've been this hot in the month of June, and it's certainly going to be dangerous on Wednesday and Thursday, but the world's not coming to an end. This is pretty typical stuff across Alabama and Georgia. All right, let's jump into your tropics. No new tropical cyclone activity is expected during the next five days across the Gulf of Mexico or the Caribbean Sea. Current conditions at the East Alabama Bee Company in Five Points, Alabama. Jeff Monroe, we're looking at 67 degrees under fair skies. We went to 93 yesterday. Wind is currently out of the north at 2 gusting to 10. That makes it feel even better out there. And look at that humidity value, 69 degrees this morning. Barometric pressure, 30.05. No rain the past 24. Sunrise this morning was at 531. Sunsets this evening at 753 p.m. So here's the deal. We'll go to 89 in Roanoke, 87 in Ashland, Lineville, 88 in Wadawi and Woodland, 87 up in Ranburn. Franklin will top out at 89 over on the banks of the Chattahoochee. LaGrange goes to 90 and Tallahassee will Top out at 94 degrees this afternoon. Certainly going to be warm, but with the lower relative humidity levels, it'll feel a little more bearable out there this afternoon. Be sure and follow us over on Instagram. We give you our fast forecast every morning in 60 seconds or less for East Alabama and West Georgia. So here's your six-day forecast from the Alpha Weather Center in nothing but sunshine all the way through Thursday with a slow increase in humidity and heat temperature. So by the time we get to Tuesday, we're in the mid-90s. Wednesday and Thursday appear to be the two hottest days of the week. Right now, we're going to put the brakes on at 99, but I would not at all be surprised to see some communities across the area go to 101, 102, maybe even 103 on Wednesday, especially on Thursday. And then we'll get a cold front uh, maybe Friday. We're going to give you a 20% chance of showers as it stands right now. 96 will be the high out there on Friday. So it's going to be a hot, dry week across East Alabama and West Georgia. Here's your Southern Union State Community College live Doppler HD radar this morning showing no precipitation across East Alabama and West Georgia. Those uh, lightning bolts you see popping up on the screen there across East Alabama and West Georgia is an anomaly. Uh, no lightning out there this morning. You see that cold front is stalled out there across Southwest Alabama back into the Wiregrass regions and across South Georgia. Low pressure center anchored there around Brunswick, Georgia with a few scattered showers right there off the Atlantic coast. And uh, you got to go really go down into Florida before you get into some big showers and thunderstorms. Uh, maybe a few sprinkles this morning around the Mobile Bay. Uh, but all in all, we're looking pretty good across East Alabama and West Georgia this morning. Be sure you follow us over on Twitter. It's at DSTREN1040. We broadcast all of our weather information on Twitter, just as we do on Facebook, YouTube, and at DrDonWX.com. Don't forget to send us those Facebook stars. We love to get the stars. Show us some love this morning. Also, check us out at drdonwx.com. That's our home on the World Wide Web. And don't forget, you get my daily weather forecast on God's Country and the classic 89.7 across East Alabama. Thank you, Mr. Darren Finch of Finch Realty up on the Lake Widawi area. He's one of our partners, as well as Miss Melissa Hughes at Genesis Weight Clinic in downtown Roanoke. If you own a business and would like to be a partner here on Dr. Don's Weather, all you have to do is send me a message on Messenger, and we can have you started by the time we do our next weather forecast, which, if the good Lord's willing and the creek don't rise, will be first thing tomorrow morning here on Dr. Don's Weather. Enjoy your Father's Day. See you tomorrow. Bye now.